My name is Jim Richardson and I am the founder of Museum Next. Museum Next is a series of international conferences for the museum sector. We hold our European conference in the spring, an event in North America in the autumn. These meetings bring together leaders of the world's best known museums, from MoMA to Tate, from the Louvre to Smithsonian, to talk about what's next for the sector. In Geneva, we have more than 600 delegates from 39 countries, so this is a very international meeting. Geneva has an international profile which we found very appealing, and it's proved very popular with our delegates, as the city is so easy to reach from Europe and further afield. The city itself is small enough to walk around, so while we're using four locations across the city, our conference delegates can walk between venues in no more than 15 minutes. As a convention around museums and culture, the city of Geneva has proved very attractive. The city has fantastic museums and galleries, and these organisations have been great supporters of our event, organising fringe activities and participating as speakers and delegates. We visited a range of conference facilities in Geneva and had lots of options. For our needs, we felt that the BFM, the old water pumping station on the Rhone, was a building which would make an impact uh, and make for a memorable event. The BFM has proved to be an incredible blank canvas for us and that, along with a network of smaller venues, have given us something really special here in Geneva. I'd also say that Geneva has been a very supportive city. Uh, we've held our event in lots of places and the city of Geneva has been incredibly supportive. And institutions and foundations across the city have offered support in the form of sponsorship. The Convention Bureau has been incredibly receptive to our needs as a conference. They suggested venues, they suggested uh, catering companies we could work with and arrange for discounts at hotels. And they've constantly been available to us to help and give advice. 